Hi, in this video, I'm going to be talking about a congenital nystagmus success story. Before I go into that, let's tell you how you can connect with us. If you're local, call us at 618-288-1489. If you're not local, that's okay. Go to our website at visionforlifeworks.com. You can do all kinds of things there. You can read success stories. You can take a quiz. You can see the things that we do in our clinic and you can schedule a consultation. All right, so let's talk about this congenital nystagmus case. So this was an 18 year old who came to us because he was born with nystagmus. And so that's hence why it's called congenital because it happened from birth. And he wanted to be able to improve his eyesight and slow down the movement of his eyes. Lots of reasons. Sometimes it's cosmetic. Sometimes people want to do this because of social situations where they don't want someone to know there's something different or unique about their eyes. Uh, they don't want to feel like something's wrong with their eyes. And so they want to make sure they can make good eye contact is another reason why many patients want to slow down the movement. What is nystagmus? Well, it is an involuntary movement of the eyes. It can come in a couple of different forms. It can go side to side. It can be what we call pendular. It can go up and down. And there's quite a few other breakdowns of it. But this particular patient just wanted to be able to slow down that movement and be able to improve his eyesight. So he started off with 2040 and 2060 eyesight. Well, the exciting thing is, is that going through our two phase program, which phase one is a unique protocol of light therapy filters or neurological light stimulating filters that I developed myself personally. Uh, this was kind of one of those things that I was bumping around with a lot of different stuff and trying things with patients for other conditions. And then by golly, I think it might work for this too. And it did. And we were really successful with it. And so we have a specific protocol with quite a few different filters. So as an example, a patient who comes in who say wants to decrease their myopia might get five or six different filters to use in their protocol sequence. But someone who has something like congenital nystagmus might get more like seven, eight, or even nine filters, filters to be able to use in this specific protocol that I developed for improving eyesight in nystagmus patients. Well, let's talk about where is he at now because he's in phase two. In fact, he's a good portion of the way, about 75% through his phase two. He also, by the way, has some binocular vision coordination problems. This is super common for patients who have nystagmus. A lot of times what will happen is if both eyes are kind of moving and wiggling all around all over the place, one eye will be chosen to be the dominant eye. The other eye then might turn in or out or up because the brain just decides, man, one eye moving around and shaking around is better to look at than two eyes moving, shaking and dancing all over the place. That makes it really hard to see a distinct image. And the bigger the movement of the eyes, then the more problematic the eyesight is and the visual acuity is more decreased. So in this individual at 2040 and 2060, he has a mild level of nystagmus. Doesn't matter, he still wanted it to be better. So we used our specific protocol. Again, fast forward, he's about 75% of the way through phase two. And wow, super awesome stuff to report because he's now equal. He's 2025 and 2025 in each of his eyes. I couldn't be more thrilled because this is a two line increase in visual acuity for his right eye and a four line visual acuity increase in his left. Beating our average and our statistics that we typically say for most nystagmus patients, which is that we usually can improve you by two lines of visual acuity. And here it is, he beat out, he got two lines and four lines of visual acuity improvement to equalize the two eyes out. He is over the moon happy. It also means that because he's able to get that really improved level of visual acuity, that he's also able to slow down the movement of the eyes. You can't stop and fixate at something teeny, teeny, tiny, far away if the eyes are still just dancing and jiggling all over the spot. So as he's able to slow that movement down, his eyesight gets better and better. 
So we're super excited for him. And if you're thinking, wow, this is me or my child or my cousin or my nephew or someone that you just happen to know who has this and you want to learn more, we do have a page on our website specifically associated with nystagmus. I would encourage you to call us if you're local at 618-288-1489. And if you're not local, that's okay. Go to our website at visionforlifeworks.com. If it's you or your child, schedule a consultation. Find out how we might be able to help improve um, you or their eyesight by yours or their eyesight by two visual acuity lines on a snowing chart. Or maybe even more, maybe even up to four lines like this young man. And if you haven't done so already, make sure that you hit the like button, subscribe to our channel so you don't miss any notifications of videos. And if this is just, hey, I'm, I've got a neighbor who has this, please pass this video on because it's so amazing and important that nystagmus patients do realize there is hope, there is a little something they can do. We can't cure it. We can't make it go away, but we can teach you how to control it better and to get better vision and eyesight overall. Thank you.